Kasi meron nga sa likod eh. O basta i-trust mo lang. Mm. Ah, under naman yung sasakyan, di ba? Kahit mag-alarm. Kasi diretso naman yan eh. Fantastic. Yeah. yeah, thank you, thank you. So we will go with him? Yeah. Okay. Do we have the jacket? <laughs> Absolutely. When you your demo, he'll bring you in here yeah. and you pick out your jacket. Absolutely. Thank you, sir. Thank Are you. Are you excited? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Is that why you're videotaping yeah. everything in here? He's got a yeah, blog. It's, I have a blog. Oh, you got a blog. How many followers do you have got? 54, I think. We have 54,000 subscribers. 54,000? Yeah. Wow. This is Marty. Marty's going to be doing a demo with you. Yeah. Oh. We'll go through all those. You don't want to bring it home with you if you can help it. To, to dump the tanks, you're going to take this cap off. This cap just twist off. Oh, it twists, yeah. And then a sewer hose will go on to, will, okay. to, will uh, screw it on to here. Okay. You're going to pull your black handle out first. Then you pull out your gray handle second. Okay, so first. So or take these bars off we jack it up so i want you to remember a pyramid okay this must be jacked up okay 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 Thank you so much. Hi, right, you guys. Good morning. Ah, uh, dito tayo sa Winnipeg ngayon. Nagpupunta tayo sa Four Season. Uh, nakabukit ng pilot namin para sa kanyang ano na no, sa installation ng receiver at saka wiring Ayan. hopefully ngayon may labas na namin kung anong sasabihin nila yung sasakyan kung may de demo na nila tapos pagkatapos ng demo eh, papablazing na rin natin tapos dalhin natin sa St. Laurent kung saan nagawa na rin siguro yung mga culvert doon puntakin ko pa yung gumagawa kung gawa na no, hindi pa malaman natin guys sa mga susunod na tagpo Of course, si Mrs. ang ano ang uh, driver natin. Imagine Alliance. Gusto mo parking? Okay. So, tara muna sa loob. Okay guys, samahan niyo ako. Pasok muna tayo sa loob. No? Sa loob mo ang? Tanya natin. Wallet lang Okay for season Papalagyan natin guys dito ng ano eh Nang parang receiver At saka wiring katulad ng ganito 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 ang dating niya eh Ganito Yan, buksan mo A few moments later Guys, binigyan tayo ng surface Okay Andiyan na si Sir Kurt Uwi muna tayo, balikan na lang na, ta, natin mamaya Kasi mga ano pa yan eh Ah uh, Siguro mga isa o dalawang oras yun Wala na ito yung gagawin dito Kasi yung RV eh, Nandun yata sa shop nila Ya tara Kapat ikaw nagdraban Dads to ha Dads guys ha Dads Binuksan na ni mami mo Ah, matag-close Eh, ilayan mo pa ganun 
Ayan, yun, nagkakandalaglagan, pulutin mo. Dapat, pag ano, pag ganto dapat tayo pag nagpupunta ng mga, ano, mga swimming, ganto dala natin, or naglalong drive. Mm. Kaya doon sakit, babas ang kalas. Hindi <laughs> na mas tumatik. Mm. Atara lights. Mm. Ano, wakang mo ito kasi medyo marumi dyan. Ito kami ganto ginawa ng misak yun eh. Mm. Ganto ginawa ng misak yan lang. Ini tanya dati sepuluh puluh, ini dodge no. Ini tuh, walang kita, ini tuh, ini tuh, ini tuh, ini tuh, ini tuh, Oh wow, dalam TV no. Blazing. Ayo na, Sibi Oke, okay. tara na, bilis-bilis ang manak Kasi may pasok pa sa ano Ayun na, inaano na nila oh Ina-inspection nila Yan sa atin? Hindi yan atin lang Ano lang natin yun? Okay Bago natin puntan yung ano Ipakita na natin kay ati Pao Pao yung Eto na Ito. Yes. Hindi al maalis yan. Yemo. Tapos. Ano infection? Infection. Inspection do bibigyan nila pa. Mm -hmm. Ano inspection daw? Hmm. Ano inspection na gagawin? No, final inspection. Oh, ganda. Tapos si Dede mo sa atin. Yan, kompleto yan. Dalawa dito. Parang dito ako, oh, tabi lang kayo ni Pao, ni ano. Hmm, yes, no. Pai Pai. Ilinisin pa nila, oh. may mga ano pa, tulo-tulo. Motion pa, oh. Hindi ito pang showroom lang ito. Pero it, ganitong ganito. Oo, oh, pero hindi atin to. Hindi. Pero ganitong ganito, show lang ito. Ito mayro pa teddy bear. Oh, yan. Kita mo kumpleto. Yung dalawa din yung pipe. Yung sa baba. Bili na pa pitong pitong una ni kasi just in case na natin pa. Oo. Siyempre kasama ka pa rin May dito. Wifi pa dito, Mami? Oh, papalagyan ng wifi ni Mami mo daw yan. Kailan ko pa sila nagbigay? Hindi ah. Oh. Mm. Ano yan? Mm. Okay na? Oke na. Itu yun, yung ganitong klase yung sa atin. Dinala doon sa loob para sa ganun inspection ni nila. Bagong bago na yun. Parehas lang to mga to mga bago, hindi pa to nakakatakbo, oh. Sarado mo, tatas mo. Si si Mommy pa pinal. Tulak mo lang. Sagad mo. Yan. 
Yon. So, mga hmm. shoes lang to? Taas mo yan. Taas mo. Yan. Ano bago yung mga yan? Bago ito mga to. Bagong bago. Ah, may nagsusin na sa akin mo. Ako magalit sa spot. Tara. Ano to ba yung bag mo? Dito ba yung susi? Nandun yung susi pa ako kasi pina ano nga yun. Pinapais nyo? Pinalagyan ng gano'n, no? Receiver. Ah, ganyan? Oo. Tara, kunin na natin yung sasakto. Bakit? Paano yung pinalagyan sa Honda Civic? Ay, hindi. Hindi kaya lang. Masyado mababa yung holding capacity ng Honda Civic. So, pag nagdadrive ko, pwede may tao sa SRB. Tinignan lang siguro sa tayo kung ano mga ginagawa natin doon. Mami? Ha? Baka yun yung atin, ano? Imagine na yun. Ay, escape pala sa atin. Pag nagdadrive ka ng, kunyari, nasa likod yung RV, nagdadrive, pwede may tao sa loob wala. Ay, hindi. Bawal yun, bawal. Sa loob. Bawal yun na bawal yun. Hindi ka nagdadrive yun, ang may kasama doon sa loob. Wala ka, hindi nga pwede yung, ano, nasa loob. July, magkaano na tayo next week. Ay, next year. Hindi pwede. Ay, hindi na natin, ah. Kaya, na Honda, ano lang to, CRB lang to, ah. Uy, hindi na lang mo lang mo lang yung sakin natin, parehas nandiyan naman. Hindi ah. Pilot din sa atin. Nandun yung sa atin, sa harapan. Kunin ko lang yung susi doon. Okay, ah, yun na han. Nainstallan na lahat. Pinayaran niya ka? Kasama na doon. Meron na. Install na nila lahat pati ano kung ano-ano pang ano dito, abubot. Diyan papasok, di ba? Oo. Ah. Tapos na 'yan. Yan yung Ay. hindi Ay. yan yung wiring ga, dito sa sasakyan, diretso doon sa ano? Sa diretso doon sa trailer. Yan. Ako hindi ko na yung susi Ako oh, pag-drive-in mo Ako oh, sige <laughs> Three weeks later Alright you guys uh, Good morning, good morning, good morning Yes! Uh, after two weeks later Nakita nyo naman Nagpapunta kami dito ulit sa 4 season dahil pinalagyan namin ng receiver yung uh, likodan nitong pilot natin. Ngayon, scheduling na ng demo. Tapos ito turn over na, na na nila sa amin yung yung ano, yung yung RV. Tapos dadalhin natin ngayon sa simbahan. Tapos diretso kami na St. Lawrence kung saan yung uh, property natin doon. Ano mami? Excited ka na ba? Yeah, si mami. Siyang driver natin yan, guys. Si mami. Si Mrs. Ayun. Delay nga kami ng 5 minutes so alas 9 ang usapan eh. Paano kasi nagluto pa si Mami ng konting pagkain. Kaya video na delay lang ng konti. Okay, okay. Babalik sa four season. Cougar. Saan ba? Yan ba yun natin? Yan yung kaya yun? Hmm. Yan yun natin. Okay. Kung yan, di. Idi, idi o. Huwag natin kalimutan yung anahan. Yung, yung, ah. Ay, yung jacket. May jacket yung bibi. Guys, tara. Okay. Hindi ko alam kung yan yun eh. Is that the the one for us? I don't know. I don't. Is it okay my vlog? Cause I'm doing a vlog for the RV too. Yeah. Is it okay my camera is on? Yeah. You don't mind? Okay. If you're here for a viewing. Yeah. You know, it's not you viewing. It's a demo actually. Yeah. So go inside. Let them know you're here. Correct. And then they'll connect you up with the demo guy. Okay. Sure. For sure. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Okay. Have a great day. Yeah. Punta daw tayo sa loobhan Sa loob Tara Ito guys yung inilagay namin Ang bayad nito guys 2,101 Kasama yung wiring At saka itong ano na to Itong receiver na to 
Yeah. Okay, tara punta muna tayo sa loob. Yan na ba yan? Sino nagsabi? Yan yung number eh. Diyan na yung number? Ay, oo nga, 1659. Ito na, ito na. 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 I just, ah, pero sa mga vlog, you know? I'm Lakay Tracker. We have 52,000 subscribers in YouTube. No worries, man. Yeah. Great. That's great. Fantastic. Yeah. yeah, thank you, thank you. So, we will go with him? Yeah. Okay. Do we have the jacket? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Daniel Demo, he'll bring you in here. Yeah. And you pick out your jackets. Absolutely. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Are you excited? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Is that what you're <laughs> videotaping yeah. everything in here? He's got a yeah. vlog. Yeah. I have a vlog. Oh, you YouTube. Vlog. How many followers do you have got? 54, I think. We have 54,000 subscribers. 54,000? Yeah. This is Marty. Yeah. Marty's going to be doing the demo with you. Yeah. We'll Hope. go through all the trailer with you. Yeah. Yes, sir. Thank you very much. You get our girls on there and it'll go up about <laughs> a thousand viewers. <laughs> yeah, the girls over there, yeah. <laughs> okay. You're in good hands and I'll see you before you leave. Yeah, yes, sir. Thank you. Okay. 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 I'm going to grab your jackets first. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. Thank you. You're still working on your trailer a little bit. So. Yeah, yeah. Okay, for sure. Yan, makuha natin yung jacket. Importante yung jacket. Guys, for the first time, I take video inside of the four seasons. So, so we got jackets and we've got hoodies. Oh, okay. What would you prefer? This one, I guess. Yeah, one jacket. Did yeah. you see the hoodie? Han hanap ka, hanap ka. You've seen your camper before, right? Sir? You've seen your camper before, right? Yeah, we already did see, see it. Yeah. Okay. Do you want a jacket or do you want a hoodie? Uh, I think this one. you want a hoodie too? I this one is better because it's. I think I like this one. Pardon? I, like, I think I like this one. I said. Yeah. Try it on, don't yeah, make sure right, it fits. When you're camping, you're camping with the tracks down. Okay, and this and one too? And this one too. Okay, when you're then? When you park it in the driveway, don't put the jacks down. Okay, so you can send Just when you're camping, you put the jacks down. I'm not going to park it. Park it. Those are just wood. Wood makes that wood. Yeah, it's just wood. Okay. That's no problem. I'm going to do it. Yeah, oh, thank you. Oh, yeah, no problem. Where do you guys live? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I mean, Khalid, sabi nyo, but we are being this in St. Lawrence because we have a we have a property in St. Lawrence. St. Lawrence? Yeah. Yes. Like um, in Quebec? No. Here in St. Lawrence. Oh. oh, oh. Saint, Saint Saint Lawrence. An hour drive. St. Lawrence. Yeah. St. Lawrence. Yeah. I was still telling the how how I pronounce the St. Lawrence yeah. because they they said they don't understand the way I, yeah. I I I say the St. Lawrence. Yeah. Saint Laurent. That's right. That's right. Yeah. Okay, come on back. Okay. Is it gonna go? Mayroon pang pajaket, guys. Ah, pajaket. Okay. First thing first. So you've got a full walkable roof on this camper. So next year, once a year, I want you to get up on the roof and just check it. Oh, we, oh, we, you don't have to do it now. It's fact. Okay. It's from the factory. It's perfect. But next year, I want you to check it. There's caulking all around the roof fence. Yeah. And the TV antennas, and the air conditioning, 
and a few years that caulking may split off okay. the roof. If it starts to split, you may get water underneath. Oh, okay. Now, you may have this camper for 20 years and nothing happens up there. Yeah. But I want you to check it once a year to make sure once it's Once a year, I'll check it. Okay. Check, okay, check once a year. There's yeah. a, the stairs in here? There, no. There's no ladder on there's this no one. Ladder. You're going to have to supply your own ladder. To get oh, okay. You got a ladder in your Except garage? The compass yeah. has the ladder. Right? Yeah, they didn't put it on this particular one. Yes. Yeah. All right. So this is just a this is just a storage compartment. Storage back compartment, here. yeah. Come to the full size spare. Full size spare with the no, full size, okay. Yeah. Perfect. And you're gonna have to use the jack on your vehicle to change tires. The trailer oh. doesn't come with a jack. Okay, so this one is uh, actually it's come with the rim. Yeah, oh, okay, it's already everything. the rim. Already. But I'm just saying it's not a donut or something like that. Oh, yeah, it's not a donut like the, like our, our car cars. it's a donut, yeah. yeah. It's a full size tire. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, um, have you ever camped before? No, no it's first like time. Yeah. First so, I'm recording. At, at least uh, I learn if uh, if I forgot something, then uh, I have to go back with my my blog so that you can. Okay. I know what I'm. And then you do. can look everything up if you if you get on kzrv.com. They've got a fantastic website on there. It'll have all the answers and questions on there if you ever get stuck. Okay. Or you can Google stuff, man. You can look up everything on the internet. How do I do some my escape? Okay. How do I do this? How do it's all going to be out on the internet? Okay. Plus, you've got an order manual on this trailer too. So oh, the that, manual. That, oh, that's going to go through everything okay. for you. Okay. Okay. Now you've got a dumping station underneath the camper. Okay. You've got a black tank under the toilet, under the trailer, which is toilet. Okay. Yeah, that's and, the toilet. And now. then you've got a gray tank, which is sink and shower. Mm -hmm. And you've got a. Um, and then you've got a fresh water tank under the floor. Okay. Okay. You've got a monitor panel on the side. That's mm -hmm. going to tell you how full the tanks are when it's time. To oh, do okay. It. So there's a monitor. There. There's a monitor panel. It's going to tell you inside when it's time to do it. Mm -hmm. To dump this, you're going to need to buy a sewer hose. This buy to buy a you need a sewer, sewer hose, hose okay. to put on. Sewer hose. And, okay. And everything you need. So where to buy that? You, you're gonna get it here. Oh, we're gonna I'm gonna it. tell okay. you everything you need to, to go camp. Okay, okay. yes, yes, okay. please. So to use to dump the, the dumping station, most campgrounds have dumping stations mm. where you can dump your your yes. black and your okay. gray. Ninety nine point oh. nine percent of them have a dumping station there. Oh, okay. For you don't sure. want to bring this home. You want to dump whatever you got in there. You want to dump it from your trailer before you come home. Okay. You don't want to bring it home with you if you can help it. To, to dump the tanks, you're going to take this cap off. This oh. cap just twists off. Oh, it twists, yeah. And then a sewer hose will go on to, will, okay. to, will uh, screw on to here. Okay. You're going to pull your black handle out first. Then you pull out your gray handle second. Okay, so first, you screw first. Yep. You screw first. Yep. And then pull the black one there. Yep. And then second is the gray one. This okay. is the gray tank. Gray tank. So you're going to open the black. That's going to get all the poop coming down. Oh, okay. oh it's separate. Okay. And then you open the gray and mm. that's going to rinse all the black down the hose. For okay, so that's if what you, it is. If you do it in the wrong order, if you put the gray open first and then the gray second, all the chunks of the toilet paper and stuff's going to get it's, stuck okay, in there. Okay, I know I get it. You understand? Okay. Yes, yes, sir. Yes. Wear a gloves when you're doing this. Eh? Don't, <laughs> no, we're going to buy it. Oh, gonna Don't buy do it with bare hands. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nasty. Yes, your, <laughs> your sewer hose goes into here. This cap just comes off. Okay. And you're going to slide your sewer hose into your fender. Sewer hose? The sewer hose that you're attaching to here. Oh, okay. After you're done using you're it, just gonna... that cap comes off. You just pull it out and you can put your sewer hose into it. Oh, okay. Then you don't have to put it in your trailer or your trailer. Oh, okay. Like that's, that. the, that's the way it, the way it goes, okay? Yeah. Uh, and the only other thing to remember is uh, don't open the pull these handles out before you put the sewer hose onto here because it's all going to come pouring out of here if so what you, do you mean what you said you want to put your sewer hose on yes, first yeah. mm -hmm. then handle second don't oh, open okay. the handles first because okay. it's all going to pour oh, all over yeah, your feet yeah, 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 you don't yeah, want that so, yeah. Yeah. okay the, yeah. the um, hose first before yeah. pulling those handles that's okay. right understand uh, yes sir yes. Okay. i just want to make sure i no, understand no, everything I, ask it, lots of questions it's no problem this is your hot water tank Okay. Um, you've got a hot water tank inside the camper. You have to winterize this camper in okay. the fall yeah. time. I'm going to okay. show you how to do it at okay. the end. Okay. But at the end, you have to winterize and put your antifreeze in here. Yeah. Uh, so that your pipes and stuff don't freeze under yes. uh, in the cold time. Yeah. And in the summertime, you have to summarize it. Summarize okay. again. Okay. And we'll cover that very last. Okay. Yes, sir. Okay. There's okay. two ways to put water into your camper. Okay. If you go unserviced, there's campsites that are unserviced that don't have water. Yes. 
and then there's campsites that are serviced to have water and power. Okay. If you don't have service at the campground, you can fill this up with water if you want to oh. before you leave for the campground. Okay. You just stick your hose in there, and it's gonna it'll fill the tank up for mm. you. Mm. If you have a full service site and you have water, you can hook your hose up to here, oh, and you got water going into your so, camp. Okay. So you're just gonna do you're just gonna keep going, yeah. uh, shower or whatever exactly. you want. You don't need to right. worry if you run out of water. Right. Or... If you put water in here, it's only 40 gallons, so you're gonna oh, run okay. out of water. But if you get full service, you we got hot water hoses here. Um, you're gonna stick this, your water hose on here, yeah. and you got constant water coming into your mm. camper. Okay. Now this is just only the refilling, and this is the full one. If, if there's a hose, you can that, fill it up before you leave from home oh, if you want to. Yeah. You can fill up your tank and leave, yeah. or you can fill it up when you get to the campground. Yeah. All mm -hmm. right. Okay. Thank you, you need sir. a water rig. No problem. This is what I do, buddy. <laughs> you're, gonna, you're gonna have a good summer. Yeah. This is a. We have a water regulator inside that we sell. Okay. And sometimes the water pressure can be too high for your camper. Uh -huh. We put a water regulator on here and it'll keep it at a 50 PSI when oh, you're camping. Okay. If the water gets too high or too low, it can damage your plumbing on mm -hmm. your camper. I've got a regulator that will keep it out of 50, and okay. you don't ever have to worry about this getting damaged. Okay, okay. so whether it's the water is uh, uh, low pressure or high pressure, it convert yeah. with that regulator. Exactly. Okay. It'll put in a 50 psi for you. Okay, perfect. We've got they're like 40 bucks. I've got them inside. Yeah. Okay. I'll show them to you. Yeah. Um, and this is, is a this is a water spoke. You've got a in the front of the camper. We haven't got there yet, but you're okay. gonna be able to plug a hose into here, and it's cold water. Okay, yeah. so, so you want spray to like, your shoes okay, or spray yeah. your frying pans or whatever and clean up. Yeah, okay. Okay. okay, got it. Yeah, all right. This is where your power cord goes in. This is our power cord, mm. but you've got a 30 amp power cord, it's 30 feet long. 30 amps, yeah, 30 it's already amp. included, right? Pardon? It's, it's already in included. The, oh, yeah, it's okay. in the front of the camper. I'll oh, show okay, it to yeah. you. This is ours. And oh, yeah. to attach it, you're just gonna put it on here and then you twist it and tighten it. Okay, that's how it is. It here. Yeah. Okay? Yes. Now there's a little bit of maintenance to do on the slide. Yeah. If you look underneath this slide, there's rollers underneath this. Yes, uh, there's a roller. You need to loot those rollers. Um, I've got some dry silicone spray inside. Okay. okay. And it'll keep the dirt out of it. It'll keep the grass out of it. Um, and it'll stop the rollers from squealing. If oh, you okay. lube them, they'll start to squeal and make all kinds of noise. Oh, okay. So you're gonna you gonna lube those wheels twice a year. Oh, twice, oh, a, twice year. a year. Okay. Yeah. All right. And I've got the spray inside. Yes. Okay. Okay. All right. What kind of work do you do? Oh, I don't work, sir. You don't yeah. work. Yeah. You stay home, look after yeah, the, kitties? the kids. Yeah, so How many home. kids do you got? Three, five. Three. Yeah. The, there's a two. Uh, they're big now. Yeah. The three one is small. So your yes. mom staying home. Yes. Stay That's a lot of work. Yeah. Yes. Only only that day is working. <laughs> it's oh. working away, so yeah. I, I need to stay home. So you got a little clip here that keeps the door open. Oh, okay. okay. Oh, there's, there's a like clip that. over here. Oh, my yeah, God. Check this out. Here that'll yeah. keep the door open for you. Everything has been uh, organized. Yeah. Oh, that's the one. Okay. This is the power cord. You, you get a, the screws. This twists turns onto your trailer oh. to tighten it and then you're gonna tighten it with this. Oh, okay, sure. If you got power on the out here, this will be lit up. No, oh, it's light up. Okay. Yeah. If there's no power, it won't light up. Mm -hmm. Alright? Yeah, and some PSI for your tires right here. 65, so you, okay. Yeah, you want to check your tires periodically, of course, just like your car. You don't want to pull it on flat tires. Yes, so yes. So check it periodically, make yeah. sure they're full. This is the tire size. Tire right. size, yeah. If you have to change your tires, yeah. that's uh, the size you go with. All right. Okay. You get a deep cycle RV battery on this camper. Battery, okay. They need to take, How long it lasts, the battery? This should last three or to five years. Five years. But take because the, if we charge in the... It might last longer if you look after it days, properly. Like, to charge it? Yes. Uh, well, you've got a solar panel on this camper. Oh, there's a solar panel. Okay. So the solar panel is always charging the battery. Yeah. Okay. Right. okay. So Solar panel, ah. Okay. But the battery Enough does. can cook food, something like that. Pardon? Everything Enough you can, can do inside food? that the will TV. be cover up. Uh, the bat, the battery will run the fridge. Yeah. It'll put the slide in and out. It'll put the awning in and out. So it does quite a bit. The battery. The, okay. the TV, the cooking. It will no. It uh, it will run the stove. Oh. The hot the hot water tank will work. The fridge will work. The only thing that doesn't work on battery is air conditioning. Yes. TV antenna and the microwave. microwave. Or the TV and the microwave. So that's runs with the propane. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 
inside. The solar panel is recharging the battery. Don't have to do anything with the solar panel. You don't have to turn it on. It's, don't don't it's have to turn it off. It, it, it's automatically. It's automatic. When you disconnect this battery in the vault time, you got to take this off the camper in the vault time. So when you disconnect this and take the battery inside, the solar panel is going to turn off. Okay. When you hook up your battery in the springtime again, the solar panel will turn off. So you're saying when we park this into our property, we, we can, we're we going to take out? I uh, know, just in the winter time. When oh, you're, just the winter. When you're done using the camper for the winter and you're packing it up, solar the, the battery should go inside in the oh, winter. Okay. The cold weather can damage this. Yeah, yeah yes, it can. Home, right? Yeah, take it home and put it yes. in the garage. And then in the springtime, when you're using your camper again, then put it um, back. Put it back together again. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Propane tank is full. Yeah. It's just like a little. How can we use the one? Like, if What's we that? like, if like we we gonna use the cooking TV, like. Yeah. First thing you're gonna have to do is turn on your shoulder, turn on your propane tank. Yes. Oh, the tank so just comes off like this. Just like oh, a just oh, okay. okay. You're just, just gonna twist just the regular it. one. Yeah. So if you want to repeal it, just remove it, right? Yeah. Yes. You loosen those things. Yeah. Yes. Oh, they already okay. have to loosen. We don't want to lose those. That's the good thing about a 20 pounder is that these things are easy to exchange. Mm -hmm. How uh, long it lasts if we cook and uh, using TV and air conditioning? How many days? Uh, the AC doesn't work off this. The, the furnace works off this. The, the stove. Um, the TV. And the, no, the TV doesn't work off propane. It's it, for the battery. It's for the okay. battery. It, the, the furnace is what will use most of your propane. Okay. If your furnace will drain, drain this in about four or five days. Four or five, four days. Or five days. If you're not using your furnace, this propane will last a long yeah. time. Yeah. So we know so how... get into the habit of turning this off. When you're not camping, yeah. get into the habit of turning Turn off it off. Oh, okay. Then you then you know the stove is off and the furnace is off and the hot water tank. You turn this off, it'll turn everything off in your camping. Mm. When you go out camping Friday night for the first time, then turn it off. Okay. okay. I guess we're supposed to be putting the hitch together for you here, right? Yeah. So you didn't want to bring your children to the dump? No, they, 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 they just, just gonna concentrate. concentrate. <laughs> we wanna concentrate this. So kids, it's just a kids, you just gonna. Okay. This is the water hose. Oh, that's the water one? This, this is okay. what the one that you spray the connection at the back. Okay. You're gonna wanna get a nozzle for Canadian tires so you can spray it. Okay. But yeah, this okay. goes into the nozzle at the back corner there. The one that's in the show, yeah, okay. Yeah. You spray your shoes if whatever you want, yeah. 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 And this. This is called a park adapter. Park adapter. This park adapter is closed. Um, this is 30 amp. This is what you're going to have at the campground. Okay. But when you go home today, you put this on the end of your cord and you can plug it into your extension cord at home. Okay, so there is. So that it don't. Uh... Yeah, it's called a park adapter. This will put it down to 15 amp for you. Mm -hmm. So when you take it home, you plug it into your garage and the kids can play in it and turn the lights on. Oh, okay. All right? Yes. So, okay. Yeah. Good. So if in campers you have to, you don't need to use it. Yeah. You can remove it. Yeah. Okay. Power awning. Power awning works off battery. Okay. Or works off being plugged into Power a Power awning system. this one? Yeah, the back okay. before it's on the inside. Okay. I'll show you okay. how cool. Okay, it is. yes, sir, yes. Um, if you look at the top of this awning, there's a little plastic cap up there. Yes. Yes. It's an override on the awning. If you don't have power to put the chat the awning in and out, yeah. you can hang you could go up there with a socket wrench and hang crank it in and out by hand if okay it will if it's not going sometimes it's stuck eh? it, it, sh it should always work yeah it's always but if you are at blue lake or far away or whatever and it's not working you can get it in and out by hand if you need to yes sir. okay now when you put the step up and down you want to make sure your door is open 100 percent 100 step up okay. and down because if the door is not open all the way it's it will scratch your door it's, yeah. yeah or it's going to tear your screen yeah you want to keep these steps clean yeah clean before yeah stones on here it's going to fall into your camper if you don't clean off your steps so you can just shake it and get the stones off the step just goes up like this yeah and just give it a little tap to mm. lock it into place okay. now it's locked don't don't push this step in too hard if you just push it hard it's going to fall right into your camper yeah so you just want to give a little tap to, to lock it like that yeah 
and then you can make these legs longer or shorter if you want to. Yeah. If, if you're on uneven ground, okay. you can push this in and make the leg longer. Okay, so that's how it is. Okay. You understand everything so far? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You guys are smart. Yeah. <laughs> and then to unlock the steps, you're just going to unlock it with this. Yeah. And put the step down. Okay, perfect. All right. Now, uh -huh. I told you to have the door open all the way for the step. Yes, sir. You need to have the door open halfway for the awning. Okay. Because the awning arm is going to come up like this. Okay, yeah. And if your door is open, like all that, the way, okay, it's, it's going to rub against your door. Oh, yeah. So you want to have. You, it you like don't want to damage it, okay? Yeah, exactly. You don't want to scratch it. Yes, yes, sir. You got a big grab handle here. Okay, oh, so it when, when it's close, yeah. it's close, and when you guys moving, you're just gonna close everything and then yeah. it also lock, yeah, okay? exactly. Got a big grab handle here to grab, mm. this will help you get into okay, the camper. Okay, yeah. Okay. It just holds like this. Okay. KZ is a Humane Society sponsor down the States. Okay. They call this a leash, leash latch. Okay. You can tie your dog to this if you want. Okay. 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 To me, it looks like a beer. Oh, yeah, I, I can open it. a lot of bottles with this. Yeah, animal. yeah, it is yes, beer yes. bottle. But it's at least like This is a vent for your furnace inside. Okay. When you get your furnace, go, the thermostat for the AC is on the inside. Yeah. When this is blowing, uh, working, this blows out hot air. Mm. So you want to make sure your little guys don't put their melt up to here or touch okay. everywhere. Okay. It won't burn them. But it'll be hot enough to scare them. Okay. So keep your kids away from here. Yeah. Then it's just a 110 receptacle. Oh, okay, so you're on outside. And yeah, you can plug, plug in a radio phone, or lights or whatever. Phone, charger, yeah, yeah. whatever, yeah. Right? Yeah. So that's everything on the outside. Are you good so far? Yes, sir. You got nice tires. Yeah, right? they, that's why I. That's why I'm looking for before they give us the one, one. Uh, one axle and I yep. told them I want the two axle. Yeah, so the trailer is going to be higher up because of these big tires. Yeah. They're actual truck tires in this thing. So th these tires should last. Yeah. They're good tires. Um, these are not for, don't pick your camper right up with the ground with these things. Okay. It's just to stabilize your camper. Okay. So when you tighten it, then stop cranking it. Don't over crank it. Okay, over crank it. Okay. Make sure you put two by fours or two by sixes underneath here. Yeah. You don't want to put these jacks down at the mud or grass or stones because yeah, yeah. it'll sink out of sight. Yeah. Some guys use their power drill on here. Mm. Power drill with a three quarter inch socket. Yeah, yeah. And then you don't have to hand crank it up and down. Yeah, yeah. All right? You yes, sir. Jack in each corner. You guys good so far? Yes, sir. Let's go inside. Let's go. Okay, let's go inside. Para ma demo nila yung ano, paano ganyan yan. May turo nila sa atin. So you got a few important things right here. Okay. First okay. thing is, you've got a power slide on this camper. Okay. So um, this slide will work if you're not plugged into your camper. Okay. It'll work off your battery. So when you bring the slide in and out, just want to make sure there's no stones or anything underneath here and scratch okay. the floor. And you just want to make sure there's nothing in the way as you put it in and out, because whatever gets in the way of the slide is going to break it. Yeah, okay. Okay, so I want you to put this slide in. Push, um, push right there. So you can't bring the slide in too far. It's going to stop when it's in all the way. Yeah, so it will really stop. It'll stop right. It's got an automatic break in it, so just keep your finger on it. When it's in all the way, it's going to stop. Just okay. Like that. Right. Then just wanna, I just wanna go check outside if how is that platen in there. Sure. Okay, and then we will come back. <laughs> I'm just gonna come back. Okay. Oh, see guys, ganyan pala plat na plat na. Okay. Sagad na sagad na siya. Ganyan pala itago ito. Eh. Okay. I guess so. Everything already, they already uh, wire everything. That's what they said. Okay. Because when we bring it here, okay. so that's what they said. Uh, they they do all, all the works. Mind if I look inside? Yes, sir. Okay. It's open. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Let's go here. I'm gonna talk to Bob about your TV set. I'll be yeah, right that's, back. Yeah. That's that's what you you told her. Yeah, oh, you have? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. So, pindutin mo pang isa dito, anta doon ako sa labas. Tignan natin. Sige, pindutin mo. Pumunta ka na doon. Oh, sige, pindutin mo lang. Out. 
Oh, uh, bus na. Hindutin natin yan. As... Punta ko. Roblog na to guys. Roblog. Okay, game. Ito mo yung distance na yan. Hanggang ganyan lang. Dito sa rat mamaya kung papaipapaano natin ito dito mamaya. Yung ano dito. Hoy, ito to. We ask them. But we're gonna put a TV in. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, we can do that. Yeah. So that uh, big enough to hold us. Um What's that? Just assessing if your vehicle is big enough to pull this. Yeah, that's what we asked before, but they said our uh, this one is five thousand can hold it. This is five thousand. Yeah. Okay. So they, they said that's I was looking at right now. Yeah, it's too big enough to hold it, <laughs> but it's uh, uh, the the holding capacity of this is five thousand. Okay. Yeah, and I was thinking also is. Hold on, uh, she, she will open it. Okay. We have some stuff in there to put. That's why. Uh, yeah, no, that's okay. It's okay. I want it to see uh, how hard it is. Okay. Yeah, how stiff it is. Okay. okay. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. TV. Yeah, I don't know, you guys. Uh, how 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 long it will take if they install the TV? Uh, I don't think it will take that long. Okay. If you need a TV. Go to Johnny, get a tech on it, because I'm the only guy here and I'm doing all the hitches. Sure, no worries. Because we, oh, we are thinking about once we finish here, we're just going to bring it into our... Oh, because we don't have any more time right now, though. I was thinking about to just get this right now. Okay. And now you're just going to pay for that supper, man? Yes. Okay, okay, okay right. please. Okay, no worries. Let me see if we can... Here's Johnny. Here's Johnny. Any more for now? Yeah. Okay, let's keep going. Yeah. <laughs> Four season will not gonna sell us the heavy, heavy, heavier than our vehicle, so if you're right? Putting a TV in, you gotta go pick your TV so a technician can get on it. Okay. I don't know what kind of TV. Yeah. We're just gonna finish probably yeah, the sure. demo. I think Johnny's already on. Oh, okay. I don't know how much. You know what TV? Uh, yeah, I think they're working on it. Let's, let's continue with the water. Yeah. Okay, yes, sir. Yeah. Yes. Let's continue it. Okay, so we, uh, when you put the slide up for the first time, yes, I yeah. want you to put the slide yes. in. You can't push this button right here. So you can't put the slide out too far. When it's out all the way, it's going to stop. Now you want to make sure there's nothing in the way out there, eh? Like, yes. Make sure there's not a tree. There's out there. nothing in the side there. Yeah. Because like okay, yeah. whatever the slides into, it's gonna dent it. That okay. that's how it is. Yeah. Okay. When it's out all the way, it stops. Okay. 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 This this is so strong. When you sit here. Oh yeah. The other side yeah, there. This, because there's nothing in there, net. So. You won't have to support it or anything. This is completely strong. Oh, okay. You didn't have. You, you'll see trailers with slides underneath them. Yeah. But uh, you won't have to support this. So strong, eh? Yeah. You can pull this one too, right? Yeah. That falls down into yeah. it. Okay. Just gonna go keep continuing. <laughs> okay. Now you get a power awning on this trailer. Okay. When you put the awning in there, right? yeah. make sure the door's not yeah. closed. Okay. And push this button right here. Okay. Let me out. Let me do out so I can see it. Okay, so first you have to you have to just like this. Yep. Before you put that power uh, that what what do you call that? And when the awning's out all the way up. Yawning. Oh okay. When the awning's out all the way it's a flap is gonna come down. Oh, okay. So keep going. You wanna make sure nothing is in the way. Make there's sure there's no tree out here. Really. Yes, yes, sir. Uh, yes, make sure there's nothing in the way though. Okay. Right here. Yes. And you the awnings out all the way. Oh, okay. Now you can't put the awning out too far. If you put it out too far, it's just gonna roll up backwards and go back in again. Oh, so that's the only far that it can go. Yep. Oh, okay. 
Well, it, it's just a little bit further. Uh, if it's windy outside, you want to keep your awning in. in okay. The oh, wind okay. can pick it up and throw it on top of your camper. Okay, yeah, right? sure. So if it's 80 kilometers, if it's ballooning up like a parachute, yeah, then the awning should stay in. Okay. Okay. Now you can tilt this awning. You can hold his arm down. Oh, that's like that. And you can tilt your awning if you want to. So if it's raining outside, the water's not gonna go it's into. Not, it's not gonna pillow on top of your awning there. Oh. It's gonna run down the awning. Run oh, okay. Or you can tilt this other end. Too. Another side there too. Yeah. You just pull this, and uh, so that the water gets. Uh, yeah, it's gonna run off. If run it's raining off. outside, it'll just pool here. You don't want it to pool on top of your awning. Yeah. yeah. So you want to tilt it or tilt it for the water. Okay, yeah, sure. Alright? Yes, so you, sir. You can bring the awning in. You don't have to straighten these arms to bring oh, the awning okay. in. You can keep them folded if you want to. Okay. It's not the fastest awning, but it's very efficient. Yeah. Forty-one seventy yeah. driveway. Okay, that's, that's right way. So you put seven hundred pounds worth of stuff in there. You're under your five. Thousand. That's that's a lot. Seven hundred pounds. Uh, I, yeah, well, that's a lot. We don't put too much. That no, yeah. Yeah. that's a lot. That's a lot. Yeah. Now, oh, okay. TV wise, we don't have one that's going to fit in there. We can order one in. What they can do today is put the bracket in. Yes, yes. Order the TV. You pay for it today. Okay. Yeah. And then when the TV comes in, all you do is come in and you'll pop it. Right just in. pick it up here, and then yeah. we just can do yeah. it. Then. Okay. Yeah. For sure, sir. So we do it that way. Yes, sir. Okay. We'll get the After. bracket. Oh, you can just do it in there. When we once we're done here, we're just gonna go in there to pay it. Yeah. We'll just we'll finish put the bracket on first and get it on. Okay. Thank you. All right, sir. You get so far. You seeing Raylan? I've got a gift card in your form for referring. You're supposed you to can give it to me and then text to him that you give it to me so that I can send it to him. Okay. Yeah, that's what he told me before. He, he was supposed uh, to come in two Saturdays ago to pick it up, but he never came. He, he, he never uh, got home yet. It's been two weeks in the road. Oh, oh. oh yeah, just uh, text to him. I give it to the store, and then when I see him, I just you know. Yeah. Okay. Let's oh, go. Let's go. Again. Yeah. <laughs> A lot of uh, advertisement, eh? <laughs> Right. So you got the uh, awning, your slide, then you got a couple of roof, you got a button here to turn your lights on. Okay. Everything including the one that's in outside? No, this one does, this is, uh, you get a little light out here yeah, this to turn it on and on. the outside, so. okay. 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 Now this table folds up and down to, to a bed. Have you seen it go up and down? Yes, sir. To long one. Okay. Can we move it down? Yeah, so this, this just lifts up like this. Mm. Give a little shake. Give a little bit of a shake and then the legs come out underneath here. Okay. And then your bed, your table will go across here. Mm. And okay. your cushions go on top. Now you can put, uh, you can sleep there if you want. Yeah. Yeah. You just lift this up like this. You look at me from the on. It comes up like this. Okay. And then the cushions will go across here like that. Mmm. Yeah, an extra bed space for a yeah. couple kids. And an extra bed, oh. That's good. All right? Yeah. Okay. All right. You got blinds here. Blind, Just okay. Oh, like wow, this. perfect. You want to keep, make sure your blinds are down, or up while you're pulling your camper. Yeah. Leave them up, because if they're down, they'll sway around and they'll be Oh, down. okay, so you have to just pull so you stay up. you want to make sure your blinds are up. Okay, so around. that they're not shaking or... That's right. If they shake around, they might get down. Okay, let's put it back. There, there is storage okay. underneath here. Oh, storage purple oh, underneath. There's storage yeah. underneath this there's one. There's storage purple underneath. And then there's storage underneath the other one, too. Perfect. See, pull it down. Okay, um, like so we're bringing this to, to the church today because yeah. for the for the blazing <laughs> for what blazing like we are uh, yeah we, we are go to the church in, 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 in church though oh Catholic. okay uh, we, we, we do blazing what's blazing it's, it's a, a saint edward catholic church yeah it's, a, it's like um in, in philippines if we get a new things like new house yeah, yeah like we this. do a blazing yeah. 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 yeah or the priest the, bless the priest. For the, so yeah. they're gonna bless your trailer yes. yeah we will do Really? That's, yeah, that's church. why we want from here. Yeah. We just gonna go straight bleed. to the church. Go straight to the oh, church. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. Do you put water on it too or no? Yeah, it's yes. uh, like uh, you holy know water. the holy water. Yeah. I've seen them do it for kids and stuff, but I've never yes. done it for a trailer. Yes. No, 
anything you want. Uh, yeah, yeah. Your so. house, house it's blazing. Just, yeah. It's just the house, cars, and this one. Really? Yeah. Yes. That's cool. Our trucks, so we, have, we also have a truck. Um, commercial truck. So. When are you going camping the first time? No, we don't go. We just because he's a truck driver, he's oh, going to go. Yeah. Going if to I don't know with my wife if she has a uh, have a plan to go with the kids, but for me, when I come here and then we plan to go, then we go. But for now, we don't have yet. Who do you drive for? <laughs> oh, Turk Enterprise. Turk Enterprise. Yeah. So is it long distance? Are you going? Yeah, I go to all, all over the place, U.S. and Canada. That kind of sucks. Mm. Yeah. yeah. It is. Well. This is how we. It is what it oh, is. Yeah, <laughs> this is how we get those for this. <laughs> yeah, that's how I pay. <laughs> so it's a, this is a one-way fridge. It okay. runs off battery. Battery. Okay. Um, so if you're plugged into power, the fridge is going to work. You can be unplugged, and the fridge is going to work up to three days. If oh, without un unplug. Yeah, if the so the solar panel is going to charge your battery, and you use this fridge up to three days, not plugged in. Okay. Not plugged in. Okay. Yeah. You can have this trailer on while you're pulling with your vehicle also. Okay, so. All right. Now to turn the fridge on, there's a little dial right here. And you just, just turn this little dial, mm -hmm. and you're going to feel just a little click there. Oh, okay. And the fridge is on. That's okay. all there is to it. Now, if you are pulling this camper with your car, I need you to put your dial on this setting right here. That's okay. sitting. Off grid, it says. Oh, no, okay. no wait, what's it say? Try it. I don't have my glasses on. Oh. But I want you to have your dial between here and here okay, okay. when you're pulling down the highway. Pulling down, okay. Or if you're camping unserviced, not plugged in, mm. I need you to have it on that setting. Oh, okay. Okay. But otherwise, I want you could have it. You could have it all the way across here and here. Yeah. But that's all there is to it, running your fridge. Just turn that. Dial yeah, on that's good. Yeah. And it's gonna go. This is your thermostat for your furnace. Okay. Furnace runs off of propane. Propane. It's not going to turn on today because it, yeah, yes. you just flip the switch on. It will. And that's your furnace now. Oh, there. it will warm up the whole. Yeah. This this will warm this camper up to minus 20. So it, oh, okay, so minus really 20 it will warm up, and, uh, warm it up. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, and it's just a thermostat. This will turn, it won't blow hot air because yeah, the propane is yeah. not turning yeah, yeah, But. Um, <clears throat> You just click it here, turn it on, it'll turn on automatically, okay. and it'll turn off automatically. Okay. Propane's got to be on for it to work. So that's all there is to running. What is that for? That's that's a, a thermostat sensor. Thermostat, oh, okay, sensor, okay. Alright, you got a little Bluetooth radio here. You can take this off and put it on your picnic table or whatever. Okay, that's Bluetooth radio. So, uh, just pla so this is the charger? Or? Speaker. Oh, that's just the speaker. speaker. Okay, down is there. It runs for the battery. There's a battery inside this. So where or do you gonna you, charge can, it? Or you can plug it in and charge it right here. Oh, you have to plug it. Okay, sure, we got it. Alright, propane carbon monoxide detector in the floor. Okay. Yes, as long as it's lit up, it's doing its thing. Okay. Remote before docking, what does that mean? Uh, this is an option that's available on your camper. We can... Oh, okay, just it, an option. It, it's okay. an option. You can, That'll read your tire pressure on your camper. Oh, okay. It costs like 700 bucks to add it. Oh, okay. So most people don't... Don't, don't get it. No. Down that here, sorry, though. Yeah, that's your propane detector down there. Okay. So if you forget to turn off your stool, the, the alarm will go off and sound. You got a smoke detector in the ceiling. That's oh, the smoke detector. The detector oh, yeah. That runs off 9 volt battery. Okay. And then you got propane, carbon monoxide, and the floor. Uh -huh. So you're completely safe in this camper. Like you've got, you've got um, alarms in here um, for everything. Mm -hmm. If you forget to turn this off, or oh, okay. if you have a fire, or whatever. Our alarms are going to sound if no. uh, if you have anything leaking. Yes, sir. Right? Okay. So you, you're going to be good in this camper. You don't have to worry about anything like yeah. that. So you got some important stuff in here. Okay. Um, okay. This this button here is your hot water tank. Okay. Okay. No, before, it's in left. before you turn on your hot water tank, you want to make sure you have water going into your camper. You don't want to turn on your hot water tank with no water. Okay. It'll burn the elements in the hot water tank. Oh, okay. okay. Put the water in, flip the switch, you're going to have hot water mm -hmm. in about 15-20 minutes. Mm -hmm. okay. Try the other one, yeah. Sure. This is your water pump switch. Okay. If you guys go camping, mm -hmm. um, unserviced, you know how I explained how you can have a hose fill up a tank? Yes. Or screw the hose onto the side of the camper? Yeah. If you guys are full service, 
you have water going to your trailer you don't have to use your water pump okay. but if you're camping unserviced and you filled up your tank with water you have to use your water pump in order for the tap toilet and shower to work. Okay. Mm. okay so right now it's they're off right? it's off right now it'll be lit up if you turn it on you can hear it going yeah but okay. uh you, you only need, need that, that if you're not without the water oh, okay okay now we'll go way back remember i was talking about the black tank and the gray tank and yeah. the fresh tank under the floor this is your monitor panel telling you that your the status of your tanks so your fresh water tank is down at the bottom as it should be and when you fill up your tank it's going to go doop, 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 like that so fresh tank is empty your black tank is empty at the bottom as it should be and your gray tank is empty so those are the ways that's, oh, that's your black is your toilet and yeah. gray is your sink and shower oh, okay all right and then yeah. if the tanks fill up it's going to go do, 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 do. it's going to raise up and it's going to tell you when the tanks are full okay, okay. it's alarm yeah it will get alarm if you need to no, no alarm dude. you'll just you'll just be just able to tell it? by the yeah okay, when, it, when it's filled up it's going to be lit right up to okay. the top okay then yeah. you'll know it's time to dump your tanks okay, okay. okay. sure okay so it is you get a um um this is your um gfi switch oh, okay you, you have a gfi switch just like what you have at home okay. so let's say that you drop your hair dryer in here or mm. your popcorn maker goes in here mm. it'll turn off all of your um plugs mm. to save the wiring stuff okay so let's say you're trying to make toast in the morning yeah you're yes. trying to make coffee in the morning and your plugs aren't working anymore yeah. check to see if this has popped out if this is popped out, you push it in, reset it, yeah, and then it all your reset. plugs will work. Oh, okay, mm -hmm. so that's the reset one. You guys are smart. <laughs> yes, because I have that one in my truck too. Yeah. That's so what I, it is. Okay. Now the toilet, you push this panel in. If you push okay. this what panel is, in, water yeah, comes, so it shoots water. out of here, and it, it will fill up your water bowl. There's a little bit of water in there. Yeah. So, um, and then to dump your toilet, you push this pedal in. Okay, so a little bit for the little water. Yeah, exactly. So what I want you guys to do, when you get out to the campground for the first time, yes. I want you to fill your tank, your toilet bowl, right up with water, right up to the top, and then I want you to dump it right away. Mm -hmm. That way, you're going to have four inches of water underneath okay. here. Okay. If you don't put any water down here, then the poop of the toilet paper is just going to... Stuck it's going to pile up and it's going to get stuck to your toilet. Four inches of water, and then every time you use the toilet, you fill the toilet bowl up three quarters of the way, and then dump it down below. Mm. That way, everything is floating around down there mm. yes. instead of piling up. Okay. okay. You need toilet chemical for your toilet. Toilet. I've got toilet chemical inside, okay. and it um, it breaks down the poop, mm -hmm. breaks down the toilet paper breaks down the gases from coming up from underneath so where are you gonna put that just drop it so you're here gonna, you're gonna drop it in you're gonna oh, put okay. it there and you drop it down oh, okay yeah. and you're gonna use one tab tablet of toilet paper every dump so mm. when you dump your tanks put another one in okay. and it, it'll stop the bathroom from smelling if you don't put it in here it'll stink in here oh, okay. okay all right and that i've got that inside too okay, okay. Yeah. Okay. You give you give us a list, right? Oh yeah. yeah. I, I'll remember everything I told you. <laughs> okay. All right. Use this shower. All you gotta do is you just got hot and cold down here. Okay. And then you've got a little button here you're gonna push, and okay. then, and this will open and close your shower. Okay. All right. Okay. Now it's only got a small. So, so a little. You got a roof vent up roof here. Roof vent still too. Okay. This will lift that off. Yeah, oh, like that. Okay. Need still, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. Nice little bathroom. Mm -hmm. Nice little water, yeah. Are your kids excited? Yeah, yes. they are. Are the coming home? They, they are thinking, yeah, they are, yeah. Are they going to be at the church when you take it there? Yes, yes yeah. we will, yes. So this is a breaker box, just mm -hmm. like what you've got at home. Yes. Um, And when in your spare time, if you look up and down here, it tells you what the breakers do. And these do pop every once in a while. Oh, it pop when, when it's like uh, overuse or the... Exactly. Yeah. If you go over 30 amps, yeah. then this <coughs> may Just pop. So, and it's very common for it to pop too. Mm. Yeah, it so is. if you come in, your air conditioning's not working. If your micro's not working, if your fridge isn't working, check to see yes. if one of these have popped. Mm. Just okay. reset it again. It's supposed to be when they are working. It's they all in the right position. Yeah, they're this. They're all on right now. Mm -hmm. And then when they pop, they'll be here. Okay. Okay. Right. Perfect. So if it's if you go over 30 amps, that'll blow. So if you got your microwave, fridge, 
AC all going at the same time, yes. you're going to be over 30 amps. Okay. So and you're going to blow your breaker. Okay. okay. And it doesn't mean there's anything wrong with your cap or anything. No. Just reset it okay. and move on. You've got automotive fuses down here. Mm -hmm. And this list here will tell you okay. the automotive fuses. They'll, they, they will run the TV sets. They will run the, mm. the lights and whatnot. If, if a fuse blows, you're going to have a light in your window here lit up telling you that you've got to blow. A blow oh, fuse. it will light up. Okay. Yeah, yeah, you'll see it here. You'll see the light. No, all right. Um, but if you um, blow a fuse, they're just automotive 15, 20 fuses. Mm. change it but if you're changing a fuse over and over and over again there's something wrong with your box you shouldn't be changing fuses over oh, and over yeah. again yep. that means there's a short yes, you know, there's or something a wire with the wiring yeah. list. The breakers they'll come and go but the fuses shouldn't be popping oh, okay okay these bunks can handle up to 500 pounds yeah i yes. see yeah. they it's can it's take whatever the kids can dish out so one two three yeah. And four. And um, yeah. So you got quite a bit of sleeping in okay, here. Okay, yeah. This piece of paper here, um, it has all your appliances listed on it. Mm -hmm. It's got your air conditioner, it's got your fridge, it's got your furnace. Let's so say your fridge stops working. That's here. Lisa's mm -hmm. gonna ask you for the serial number and for the model number on the fridge. Oh okay. And that's all here. Oh it's all right there. It's okay. all on this piece of paper. We can't do service on this camper unless we know what the model and serial number oh, okay. is. And that's the only way to know what they are is right there. Oh, okay, thank right. you. So don't throw that away or anything. It's an yeah. important piece of paper. Just a little basic stove. You're just gonna use a lighter to light start out, okay, to open it. Okay. So you're just gonna put it on light, lighter, flick and she'll go. Mm. Okay. So push in to turn on, push. Uh, you gotta push it in and then on spin this. it. And then you and put then it on light, light, light it, oh, and then okay. you've got high and low right okay. here. So, okay, on microwave oven, yeah, that's basic microwave basic with microwave turntable oven. in it. Oven. So it's basically you cannot just do it at the same time, cooking a microwave oven, or yeah, if you want to, they can, but. Uh, if it's turn everything on, it will pop up anything. Well, the, the, the stove is propane. Oh, I saw. So okay. this yeah. won't go toward the 30 amp at okay. all. Yeah. This is where your owner's manual is here. Mm -hmm. It's got yeah. owner's manual. It's got, the, um, it's got a manual in here for the fridge, furnace, hot water. Oh. Everything is in here. Everything is in there, too. All right. And then if you go on kzrv.com, their website, mm -hmm. there'll be all kinds of information on there, too. Perfect, um, yes. For running your camper. All right. Two sets of keys. I'll just leave them right where they are. Yeah. Uh, oh, this is the sink. Oh, wow. Yeah, sink, big sink. Sink with the uh, chopping board. Yeah. That's what it is. And this one, you're just going to turn on on? Yeah. No water, right? Uh, no, there's no water. Maybe a trickle will come out of there. Yeah. So the water, we're just going to turn on in there, right? Again? When you want to use the water here, you're just going to turn on in there? Uh, well, if you're hooked up to a hose on the outside, yes. it'll this will turn on. If oh, it's the automatically there is in here. Yeah, okay. there'll be pressure on the hose okay. that'll make this work. So, if you if you are not hook, hook, hooking outside, so you only have a water in the in the in your tank in yeah. there, can you also use that? Yep. Yeah. So how does no, just turn on in there. Where, where did you say? If that? you're not hooked up to water, you turn on your water pump. That's on. Oh, right, oh, that's, panel that's the one again. Yeah. Yeah, Just yeah. wanna make sure. You gotta turn on. Oh, the water that's pump. The, okay. Lock, lock. All right, sir. Uh, permission really to drive your vehicle to hook you up. Okay. Yeah, sir. Okay. Yeah. Keys. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Thank you, Yeah. He's already. He already put everything in. Oh, he already in. Yeah. I have to put the ball on to dimensionally set the rest of it. Oh, okay, sure, for sure, sir. Yeah. Just gonna keep yeah. continue yeah. doing. Brother. Yeah. Brother. Brother. Yeah. Okay. Sir, it's too old. Okay. <laughs> yeah, all right. So this is your air conditioner up here. Okay, air conditioner. You have to be plugged in the power for the air conditioner to work. Okay. And um, you just got basic settings. You got. Oh. Um, you got a fan on here and an air conditioner on here. Not so strong. So you can put it on low fan if you want to. Put it on high fan. Or so there's two low fans there. So they yeah. do the same thing. Low fan, low fan, and high fan. And then you can put it on low cool okay. or high cool. High cool, okay. 
And then this is your thermostat here. This will make it colder, colder. Oh, okay, I colder and colder. Okay. All right. You've got this little button on the front that will. This will turn your vents on and off on the air conditioner. See oh. now it's blowing it. It opens blowing and closes. Oh, okay. And the same thing here. Okay. Uh, you've got. This air conditioner will work great. Like it'll be minus 35 or plus 35 outside, and this will keep your trailer cool. Okay. Um, there is a filter back here. If you take this cover off, there's a filter right here. Okay. So you need to rinse that once a year. Once a year. Okay. Water. Just rinse it. Okay. Underwater, then you put it back there. Yeah. So when you cook, so where is there any? Um, they smoke pansak here inside. <laughs> yes. The thanks for asking. Ben, yeah. Yeah, there's a fan. So when you cook here, so where it goes the... The vent? I think this is the vent. This can also the vent? No. Can suck the... There might not be a fan in this camper. Or open the window there. Yeah. You're gonna open your window. Yeah. There's a window here that you can open? Yeah, this yeah. window goes... No, that window doesn't even open. You're gonna be open this vent here, right here. Uh, oh, yeah. For cooking yeah. Yeah. inside. Yeah. There's a TV going here? Yeah. Where? Do you, did you decide where you want? Yeah, that's so what goes in there. Right. It's going to go right there. Yeah. Okay. You're just going to put the thing, I think the bracket so in we'll there. So we'll have to install the bracket once we have a TV and because if we just install it, install it anywhere, then we have to see how it fits with the TV. Yeah. Um, yeah, we can install it when he comes back. Yeah, I just installed it. Because we didn't have any TVs. Okay. This folds up and down into a bed. Yeah. This just folds down like this. Okay. So you could put a couple people there, no problem. And then you got storage under. No, you don't have storage. Just a slide underneath. Right, tayo na mo mula sa ng TV. Yeah. And the blind goes up and down like this. Okay. You can't. The lights turn on and off like this. There's a little button in the middle. Oh, okay. Yeah. okay. You can turn the okay. light on and off. These ones, these ones Same in the thing. middle, they'll work on the button. Okay. There, or you can turn it on and off here if you want to. Right. You got a light switch here. Okay. Or you can turn it on and off here. Okay. So you you cannot think that it's uh it's a uh, busted, right? So because you yeah. cannot uh, you can yeah, do something it's got in there. Individual buttons. Okay. And then there's storage underneath the mattress. Oh, there's a storage underneath the oh, mattress. A little bit yeah. of storage underneath there. Yeah. Also in the other side there, no? Uh, there's storage on the outside. Oh, then there's in there. oh the one that's in there. Oh, we saw yeah, it. The one yeah. that we saw it. Yeah. Now, these mattresses are not great. You're gonna, you're probably gonna want to get a new mattress and yeah. like sit on this thing. It's soft. Yeah. So count on replacing this mattress. It's an RV mattress. It's not terribly soft. Mm. Yeah. Then it's got a blind in the front there also. There's also a blind there. Okay. That's pretty much all I got for you. Yeah. That's, you, that's, that's how it is, I guess. You see me along home. So I'll be back in a second. Yes, sir. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. 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 Ganyan lang pala yung ano, ni-install niya lahat. Yung baba na ng ano. Alright, that's how we do it, right sir? Yup. Just gonna go get my raincoat on. Okay, so that's how you do it, your... You'll get a full explanation at the end. Okay, perfect. In the That's meantime, I need to concentrate on this. Yes, one. sir. <laughs> okay. Brother, brother. Brother. Oh, there's the solar panel. That's oh, the panel. to show you your solar panel is working up and down. So, like you said, your solar panel is going to run your fridge for about up to three days. Three days. Three not days. plugged in. Not plugged in. Okay. But on solar, <laughs> you can't run your AC. You can't run your microwave for okay. bugs, but. But it will run, it will put your awning in and out, you'll put your slide in and out. Okay. We'll run your lights mm -hmm. and your fridge. Okay. So you don't really have to touch that. Yeah. Okay. No. The owner's yeah. manual for it is in the owner's manual. And you yeah. shouldn't yeah. have to if it's jumping up and down like that. Do not put anything in there too. 
Yeah, you can, you can put stuff in there. It's the biggest pipe. On the other side. Okay. Alright. Are you guys good? Yeah, this is for the thing in there. That's where you're going to plug your TV side in. We're just thinking about to just put the bracket here and then we can just buy a TV probably later or... We could do that. Yeah. That's the only. So that we're not gonna come here. Then you just come back. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Let's jump over. Is that normal? Can you check it? No. Tire pressure. Yeah. Hmm. Dali na lang yun. Ako na bala. Tire pressure. Kasi yung ano lang yun. Meron ka lang gauge na na bibili na katulad na sa sakyan. Para lam natin yung pressure lang yun. Sixty five. Magmalalaman mo. Toto. Meron ako sa truck. Dali ko. Paka ano? Bleed na yun. Time for the explanation. Yeah. Part of it, I wanted to make sure everything was closed. Yeah. Um, when you hook up, make sure your jacks are up. Up. Yeah, those jacks are up. So okay. I, was, I was making sure that uh, no one had touched them while I was uh, away. Yes, sir. Okay, so here's the explanation. Are you ready? Yes, Mom? sir. It is uh, Sir uh, Brother. Oh. Brother Paul. Brother Paul, yeah. Brother Paul. He's the okay, one. Okay, here's the explanation. Here's your trailer. Yes. Here's your car. Uh huh. Connects with the ball. Okay. The process you're about to see. Oh, I need to hold this. I just spotted. I was on my way to get this pin when you showed up. Okay. I'm gonna get this pin before I get into that. Yes, sir. Charo, ikaw na ibalik natin tama. Pamamay mo, pisin mo, magamay mo, liparin pa mamay sa ayon yun han. Or season yun. there okay now we're ready for the explanation yes sir sorry, sorry to interrupt your beautiful video <laughs> no worries okay so we'll start again are you ready yes sir so here's your vehicle yeah here's your RV yeah. connects at the ball the ball okay yeah in order to install or take these bars off we jack it up so I want you to remember a pyramid okay this must be jacked up in order to install or remove these bars. Okay. That's the process you're about to watch. Okay, yeah, okay. Are you ready? Yes, sir. So right now, we're jacking. I'm gonna crank this up. Okay, it's now oh. starting to lift it up. Yeah. Crank more. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to crank this up. Yeah. Because I did it before, I know how much. Yeah. This bar is now ready to come off. Okay. We take the pin. Yeah. Pull the pin out. Be aware that when you put these pins in, they always go this way. Okay. Because in theory, if I put it in this way, a rocket hit it and pop it out. Oh, okay. So they always must go in the other in way. This direction. Okay. So once it's jacked up, the pyramid that I want you to remember, which is lifting it up. Okay. Now this can come off. And there's a there's a switch here. Yeah. You pull it forward. Forward, okay. And it slides out. Slide out, okay. Same thing in the other side. Okay. And that's how you install or remove. Okay, install and removing, okay. Have you owned a trailer before? No, sir, it's first time. Okay. Yeah, it's a lot of explaining to do, though. <laughs> Move the other one again. Yeah. This will slide out. Mm -hmm. Do you see this button here? Yes. And I lift this up a little bit, a so, little bit yeah. so the shaft can float out. Yeah. Okay. 
so it's now out. Out, oh, okay. Now, in order to disconnect the ball, uh -huh. yeah. I have to take this weight off it. So okay. I'm going to put it back down. Back down, okay. And I know that it's down when the wood moves. When the wood moves, there's no load on it. So when the move, okay. Yep. So, so when now the, move, the wood moves, there's no load on it. Okay. Okay. So now I can uncouple the ball. Okay. And now I can crank the trailer off Up the ball. Okay. I'm not going to crank it all the way off because it'll separate. Yeah. But I want you to see it's lifting up. Okay. It will pop off the ball and then you're disconnected. Okay. And then you just have to undo your chains, unplug your wire. Any questions? So when we are going to uh, remove it, just pop it all the way up. So how to connect it when we remove it all the way? Sorry? How to connect the... Uh, any technique? How to connect the... Because we cannot see it? Well, you drive under the ball and you drop it just as I... With this, right? Okay. Okay. Right? Like right now I just lifted it up. Okay. You drive under it and you drop it on. So that is already connect, uh, uh, disconnect, right? Not on those chains over there. Yeah, okay. no, the, you need to remove the chain. Yeah. You have to remove the chains once you're disconnected. Okay, once you're disconnected, like that is disconnected yeah. already. So now I'm, gonna, I'm gonna, now gonna couple this back. Yeah. Put this on. Okay. Now so. I'm gonna send this up to install the bars. Hey, Sebi. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hey, did you just see that one I just missed with passport? Yeah, just got it. I absolutely did. But it, it, it's easy, though. You have to get a, a rhythm to it. You have to pop it oh in. Oh, so, do it for you, hon. Kasi ikaw, ano. Eh, sabay mo. Eh, ano mo dun sa alarm, ha? Hindi kasi balance yung bakal mo, eh. Ano? Hindi, balance mo. Balance mo. Ano oh, is that? Oh. Bumaba pa yata. Nakalak na. Ano? Wala ka mo mapag-aralan yan, kung wala ako. Jesus Christ. Do like that? Okay, you gotta snap it in. Baka sa side. Pag ganyan ka, ganyan. Pag ganito ka, dito. Hindi mo may lagay? Ayan mo. Okay, you take the camera. Okay. You're going to learn how to snap this yeah. in. Super, you have to hold this in here. This yeah. is your this is your key here. Yeah. I lift it all the way yeah. to the top. Yeah, and then you got to snap it in. You have to make sure it's it's a uh, label. Let me in there? Yeah. No. I've probably done too many. So once I got it to the top, then I... Is it already locked in there or you have to push down? You don't normally have to release the switch, but it's also brand new, never been used. Good. 
Oh, that's it. You have to fold that thing, though. Well, it's brand new. It's, it hasn't been broken in yet. Okay. So I pulled this out in order to help it snap it in. Okay. Once you know it's snapped in, you're good. Can I do it? Can I do it? Yeah. You cannot remove it, you cannot put it back. But it's, uh, it's supposed to be not needed, right? Okay, now that's perfect. So, yep, so I want to show you something. Okay. So, if I crank this more, this bar comes up and it slides oh, okay. on. Okay, but. Yeah. I deliberately didn't have it that far up yeah. because I want you to know what this tool is. This is called the Persuader. Oh, okay. And in the event, if you can't get the bar on, you use the Persuader. You put it in like this. You pop oh, it, it in. goes, okay. So I wanted you to know what this tool is for, so that's, that's why I didn't have it. But normally you just jack it up the bar will swing up and it just slides on if you don't want to use that yeah this well this is only if normally you're off a nice uh, level plane uh, ground yeah uh, otherwise you don't really need this oh okay but yeah. it comes with the uh, the hitch it's part of the manufacturing equipment I want you to know what it's for so I'm gonna put this up here for you yes sir also be aware that here's your manual for the, okay. Next spring, if you want a quick video to refresh you on your hitch, yes, yes. Just punch in Kurt on YouTube, uh, the Kurt hitch, and you'll get a beautiful video to refresh you as well. Thank but you. All you have sir. to remember is the pyramid. You got to be jacked up, okay, in order to install or remove the bars. Thank you. Just everything in there. Excellent. So now that we've got the bar on. Just, okay. just a refresher, we're always going to put this pin in this way because in theory if it was this way, a rock could pop it out. Okay, yeah. So it always goes in this way. Alright. So now I can crank it down. This is your wooden block. Yeah. And I'll put it in your front uh, storage yeah. for you. Yes, sir. You'll get a strong arm by... Uh, <coughs> by the end of the summer. Mm -hmm. Crank all the way up, eh? Yep. Yeah, you want it all the way up so that it uh, doesn't get any uh, damage from, you know, rocks and mm -hmm. road debris, stuff like that. So right now it's fully protected here. Yeah. Right there. So we're good to go. And I'll put this in your front cubby for you. Yes. So I've already checked your lights. The only thing that's left is to make sure that your uh, brakes are working. Okay. And I, it looked like you had a brand new brake controller in there. Yeah, they, they just uh, installed it. Right. You probably have never used it. Never. So I'll give you a full explanation. You'll definitely want that on your video yes, as well. Sir. That's awesome. Outstanding. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So I'm going to get you to jump in the front. Okay. One of the last things I do is walk around. Yeah. Making sure that everything is ready for you to actually move. Okay. I'm making sure that your jacks aren't accidentally down, the stabilizer jacks. I'm making sure that the stairs are up. Yeah. These are the things that people uh, miss. Yeah, sometimes you miss it, yeah, and, and because you're in a hurry. Them. Pre-trip. Well. Doing some kind of a pre-trip. These are all fabulous. And this one is good, so we're ready. Yes, sir. We're ready for your brake yes, control explanation. 
Yeah. You can jump in the front uh, Try M the one? Yeah, you can jump in. Yeah. Now well, you're driving, so she's gonna take that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Fire up the machine. Okay, your brake controller is right here, right? Okay. So you just see the zero zero? Yes. yes. When it's set at zero zero, there's no brake. Okay. Okay. We're gonna see what your high number is. Usually goes to 100. This is going to go to 100. It's at 96, 99. So when it's at, when it's at the highest number, that's like the brakes are max. They're like locked and loaded. Okay. They'll, they'll drag. So we're going to start you at approximately 65. It's just a starting point. 64. Yeah. Okay. So that's a starting point. So as you do your journey, what I want you to do is if you happen to be pulling up to a red light and you want and you notice that the surge inertia, you want to go through the light, you're really pushing on the brake pedal, means you want more brake on the back, mm -hmm. increase this number. Okay. Just push that. Yeah. This is just to set it up. It's all being controlled through your foot pedal. Mm -hmm. So be aware that if you want more, you see the little spindle here? Yeah. Yes. That's what I was turning to increase or decrease the brake okay. number. So if you want more brake in the back, increase the number. If you want less brake, if it's braking too much in the back, mm -hmm. then lower the number. And it's as simple as so that. Just what, what, this. what number should then, be? 65 is good? It, yeah, it's a starting point. Starting point. And okay. you as the owner, you're going to adjust it. Uh, to your liking. You're either going to increase or decrease depending on the feel. Okay. Because as you drive, you, you, you want to yeah. correlate the two vehicles. Yeah. yeah. You don't want the trailer doing 90% of the braking and, and, and the vehicle 10, right? So it's, it's a starting point. So now we're going to test your brakes. So you see this squeeze button? Yeah. When you squeeze this, that's turning the trailer brakes on manually. On, okay. So what we're going to do is you're going to put this in drive with your foot on the brake. Okay. Put it in drive with your foot on the brake. Foot's on the brake. Yeah. Okay. Keep your foot on the brake. You're in drive. Yeah. Okay. Squeeze that button. Okay. So now the trailer brakes are on. Now when you let go of the brakes, you should roll ahead and the trailer will stop you. We'll hold, okay. Yep. So let, let your foot off the brake. Give it a little bit of gas. Yeah. Yep. See, the brakes are working. Yeah, it's working. Okay. Trailer brake is working. Yep. So now release the switch. Give it a little bit of gas to show that you're going forward a bit. Oh, I had your emergency oh, brake okay. on. Yep, release that. That's why, okay, we're gonna do all that. Is. Let's try that again. Again, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Squeeze the brake. Squeeze the brake so that the trailer is on. Yeah. And then... Let your foot off. Yeah. And you saw that the trailer it's stopped you. Yeah, it's tugging you, okay? Yeah. So that's perfect. Your brakes are working excellent. Okay. So remember, every time you, you uh, uh, what do you call this? You, uh, you do braking, you have to do this? No. That's just to set it up. Started okay. the journey, right? Yeah. Just, just yeah. started now the journey. You just drive normal now. Okay, no. I thought you remember you. Oh, yeah. you're coming. You need to stop. You have to. Yeah. No, you don't no, need no, to. No, 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 okay. no. That, that's just to test it okay. separately. We wanted to see that it was working. Okay. The only thing that you're going to do is increase or decrease the number if you want more Depend. or less on the yeah. back. Depending Depend your uh, and, feelings when driving. And it's as simple as that. Okay. Think a higher number, higher brake, lower number, lower brake. Okay, yeah, sure. 65 is normally the average that most people adjusted okay. to. Yeah. 
but just be aware that if you want more, increase the number, and if you want less, lower the number. Okay. All right, sir. So you well, we, we are going to uncouple the trailer now because we need to do the... What's this called? The yeah, MPI. I think I don't know. We have to yeah. do the um, because I thought they already have seven days, but it's already expired. What's that? The MPI. No, the trailer, the, uh, trailer uh, license, license. plate. What are you telling me? Um, we need to uncouple the trailer first because um, we need to go to see him first. Are we done? Once we're done, yeah. Yeah. Okay. What he's doing? Yeah, go he's... see him. I don't know if he's gonna give you a seven day or not. Okay. It's already done. They said. And you I have know, a seven here. day or it's expired? It's expired. So you, so we you, you want to disconnect in yes. order to go buy a plate? Later, yes. later. Yeah. We're just going to talk to him first. Okay. Yeah. Go get him first before Very we... Good. Okay. Are we thank done, you, sir? Brother. We're done. Thank okay, you, sir. Thank, thank you. you. <laughs> okay. So if you're going to disconnect to go get a plate, uh, I'll let you disconnect to, yes, to so learn that, the procedure. Yes. I have to talk to him first. Okay. What, if, what he's uh, saying to us. Yep. Because he great. said he will go to do something else. So... Yeah. Sounds excellent. So, what is this for here? This is just nothing? Uh, no, this is your emergency brake switch. If this ever comes uncoupled, it pulls this switch right here. Okay. And it turns on the brakes so the vehicle doesn't keep traveling down the road. Okay. Yeah. So, is that really like this or it has to be hung? Because yeah. it touches it, it uh, the ground. There's not enough slack. We normally put it through here to keep it away from the ground. But in this case, I have it above the bar so it can't get too low to the ground because you're not quite enough there it's a little too tight to put it through here because <laughs> if we hit something so i prefer to put in here probably how about this one the top here there's nothing in it's not going anywhere right it's not this one is not connected to anywhere right okay so go inside do finish your paperwork and okay then, and then i'll let you disconnect so you can learn this better yeah and then you can go get your plate. Yes, sir. Okay, thank you. Yep. All right. Well, we had the little one that we bought right. from. Uh, the Oh, nandito pa kami sa four season mare. Inaayos pa lang namin tawag ng missis kita mame. Pero palis na rin kami. Kaya siguro uh, ma, ma grade ready kay Basita na. Natan. Ito na rin si Natan. Oh, data kaya on? Ang pay mo at papang pay pay lang. Oh, ang bagang kano mapang uh, undawi kami nito nito kasta kung kay Guru Uray. Ah, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Dito, dito in rumor kami kung mapang kami alam nito kijo bing inyo orsan ayah. Ni ah, agile ben sakto kita alas 12. Alas 12. Oh, sige ikaw mi lang bit datay. Okay. 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 Tanong ko mo doon kung meron. Hindi mo ma-indict kitang kita na noon. Ang luwag niyan, hindi mo kailangan ng salamin niyan. Ayusin mo lang yung salamin mo diyan, han. Ibaba mo, ibaba mo. Ibaba mo. Ibaba mo. Ayusin mo lang yung salamin han, i-wide mo lang itong mga ito, hindi mo kailangan ng salamin yan Oh Hindi naman siya kitang kita naman eh Oh, ano pa bang hindi mo makikita dyan Oh Oh, i-atras mo ng konti doon Kasi meron nga sa likod eh. Ang basta mo lang. Kahit mag-alarm naman yan, wala nang problema yan eh. Under naman yung sasakyan, di ba? Kahit mag-alarm. Diretso mo lang yung gulong mo. Kasi diretso naman yan eh. teach my wife properly too and pour this thing down
now you're starting to lift it up. Remember the pyramid? You gotta yes. lift it up yep. to take the load off the bar. So now crank more. Yeah, crank maybe 20 revolutions. You'll notice it's coming up, right? The, the yeah. pyramid. Yes. Right? That's what I want you to remember in your mind, the pyramid, which is to lift it up. Okay, so that's it? No, yeah, a little more, a little more. Okay, that's good. Yeah. Okay, so now you can pull the pin. First, pull the pin. Okay. And hold this. Slide this forward. Okay. We got this. We can get rid of this. Yeah, well that's just unplugged. So you don't. You're not disconnecting. I'm disconnecting. I want to disconnect, then we put it back. But you're, yeah. Oh, okay. So that I know that properly. That's, yeah, okay, that's fine. So so this is now, now you got to lower this down. You have to lower this down to okay. take the load off to, to disconnect this. Oh, okay, sure. That's the second step, huh? Yeah. Lower it down. Yeah. Okay, so until this one is no more weight. Yep. Okay. You know the load's off, right? Okay. So now, you, that. you can open this, slide it back, mm -hmm. so you okay. can now crank it off the ball. No, crank it off. Yeah. But I don't want you to crank it all the way. I yeah. just want you to lift it up. You see that it's lifting up. Okay. Okay, that's it. Yep. So it's slowly lifting off the ball, right? Yeah. Okay, so when we remove the truck car, they, it, will, it will, what happen? You have to remove this one here. Keep cranking, do the whole thing. Oh, okay. Do Keep the whole cranking, thing. yeah. Break it till it's off the ball. Yeah. That's what I want to I want to see. Yeah. So, so you see it's off the ball now? Uh there's few yep. more. Keep going. Okay. So you're you're now off. Okay. If your chains were uncoupled, you could Drive away now. So this this one is stay here, right? It's not going anywhere, right? You don't need to remove it here, right? But, well, when you're done, you can remove it. There's still lot in there, yeah. Okay, take your chains off. Chains off. Just like that. Okay. Okay. You'll need to come to this side to do this side. This one, when we leave is should we remove this one or stay connected in the car? This one. You should you should um, you should take it off because you don't want someone to steal it. Oh, okay. And, and to take it off, you're gonna you're gonna pull this pin and you this stick this will slide out. Okay. And this it, one is easy to take to it's heavy but you can pull it out. Oh it's easy to yeah. The one is easy to the we buy something stop the for the lock one. No? Wait, where the one is close? Can't. I need you to drop this on the ball. Where did they put the the, the lock? The, the lock. Those are the things that I wanna know. Okay, so that I can just we just come back here and just gonna call this one. Where this one is close? Okay. Right now, I need you to drop this ball on there before the set. 
drop this ball. Oh, what do you mean by drop? Drop the trailer onto the okay. ball, or, you, or it's going to separate and you won't be able to do so. Okay. So drop the trailer? Yeah. What I'm saying is you need to re reconnect this. Okay, re reconnecting. One okay. thing at a time. Okay. Yep, keep going. Close the close this one. Yeah. Just like that. Yeah. Now put the pin in. Well, that, that is close. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. This this pin prevents this from uh, being open. Okay. 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 You're gonna install the bar on this side. I'll go to the other side. Yeah. Because I don't want this too close to the ground. Yeah. When I had it like this, it was too close to yeah. the ground. Yes. So what I did is I swung it over and put it on this side. Okay. So that it's not too close. It's not too close. This, this is keeping it up. Okay. Anna, go over and help us put that on. That one. Hold that. Because we don't want to actually don't have any idea how to put those things and then we just gonna call when we just got got out here. So since we're already here. We're gonna know everything else. Yeah. So instead of me separating this, which yes. would have taken a long time, I'm just yeah. gonna go to a trailer and show you. Okay, yeah, perfect. <laughs> so this is simply an anti-theft device. Yeah. Right? 
you never know, someone will steal it. Absolutely. Yeah. We had one stolen off our lot somehow. Did? Yeah. Okay, so here this lock. Han, no more. So when your trailer's disconnected, yes, sir. You take the lock. You put it in here. Okay. This goes in like that. Okay. Another side. All oh, right. And you turn it. So, that one so now no one can hook up and steal your trailer. No one, that's not going anywhere now. Okay. Yeah. And that's that. Yeah, thank you very you. much, sir. I think thank I... You... You give me a lot today. You betcha, brother. <laughs> All right, thank you very Cheers. much. Sir. Cheers. Yeah. And welcome to your home away from yes. home. Yes, yeah, thank you, so sir. important, don't lose these keys. Yeah, Make sure she has you, to put in there. Make sure you have his and hers, yeah. one on each chain. Never keep two keys in one spot. Yes, sir, thank you. Thank you so much. What do you want to have? So this will we'll put in the front copy okay. of your trailer. Yeah. I think that's everything. So now you need to, now you need oh, to yeah. jack this up. Jack and, this up. And put the wooden block inside the uh, cubby. Just a little one. Okay. This one's not going anywhere, right? There's a key that you got under. Yeah, your keys. Do you have your keys? It's inside. Yeah. All right, I guess that's everything that's it. Yes. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank you, sir. Why don't you just take some picture with my wife? Yes, oh, this one's good. You. Yes, that, that's good enough. Okay. Yeah. All right, sir, thank you. You're welcome. Yep, thank you very much. So you are welcome, All right, brother. thank you, sir. All right, you guys, ayan. Uh, pina-receive na nila sa atin yung RV sabi nga nila such a small vehicle to haul a big uh, uh, RV yan guys pero sakto naman ito sa hauling capacity nya eh ang hauling capacity nya is uh, dry ito is only uh, 4,000 uh, 5,000 ang gross nya uh, yan eh yung ano natin ang pilot natin ay eh, bumabalo siya ng ano ng uh, 5000 hall
Bye. Peace up. Lakai Pinoy Tracker.